subtraction of rational numbers. So how we need to subtract and what is the rule? So just we'll see. So let us see this subtraction of rational numbers. So what is the rule to subtract any two rational numbers? So first we will see some rule. Rule is nothing but to subtract one rational number from the other. We take the additive inverse of the rational numbers to be subtracted and add to it to the other rational number. So subtraction is nothing but addition only. But we should take additive inverse of another number. Okay, I'll explain it briefly. For example, A by B and C by D. Then we need to subtract C by D from A by B. So what will take A by B as is. So what we need to add? We need to add additive inverse of C by D. Additive inverse of C by D is minus c by d so minus c by d if you add to a by b then there is nothing but subtraction because the inverse of c by d is minus c by d that is a by b minus c by d we can write i'll explain you some examples so let's take one question subtract minus 5 by 6 from minus 3 by 4 so from minus 3 by 4 that means my, my okay we have to subtract minus 5 by 6 only so according to the rule so as per the rule what should take minus 3 by 4 because this is from and we have to subtract minus 5 by 6 that means I should add add it to inverse of minus 5 minus 5 by 6 add it to inverse of minus 5 by 6 so add it to inverse of minus 5 by 6 is plus 5 by 6 that is minus 3 by 4 plus Additive inverse of minus 5 by 6 is plus 5 by 6. So finally, minus 3 by 4 plus 5 by 6. So 4 comma 6 LCM is 12 because you know how to find LCM. So in 4 table, so that denominators we must make it to LCM. So in 4 table, when 12 because 4 into dash is 12. 4 into 3. Same 3 we should multiply for even uh, numerator also. That's what 3 into minus 3 plus next to 6. In 6 table 12 is 2 times. 2 are. So 2 into same fraction numerator. So minus 9 plus 2 5 is a 10 by 12. Minus 9 plus 10 is 1 by 12. So 1 by 12 is the answer for this. <coughs> So this is the way we can do subtractions. I'll tell you one more simple question. One more problem let us see. So example is like this. What number, for example, in generally natural numbers we'll see. Now for 5. And what number I need to add to 5 to get 8. So what number? We need to add to 5 to get 8. That is 3. So how do you know 3 means from 8? Directly this 5 you subtract. Because 8 minus 5 is equal to 3. Okay, what we need to get from what number you should add means that only subtract from the result. So this one we will see here. What number should be added here? Okay, this is added. What number?
should be added to minus 7 by 8 yeah, to get 4 by 9. So what number we need to add to minus 7 by 8 to get 4 by 9? So what number we should add means take some x it is. So let the required number is x. Then solution is minus 7 by 8 plus some x we need to add to get 4 by 9. So this we need to simplify. So we need to find out the x value finally. So x is equals to 4 by 9. So minus 7 by 8 is if we interchange it is nothing but added inverse. That is plus 7 by 8. Because here negative 7 by 8. When you take another side it will become alto inverse. That is a plus 7 by 8. Then the remaining is a normal procedure. 9 and 8 else is 72. In 9 table 7 to 8 zone. Then 8 into 4. So 32 plus here in 8 table 72 is 9 zone. 9 into 7 is 63. Then that is 95 by 72. Now this is the required number. So this if we add 95 by 72 for that the given question, then we will get 4 by 9. Similarly, they ask what we need to subtract to get. This is what we need to add. So we will get some questions what we need to subtract also. Okay, let us take one more question what we need to subtract type. What should be subtract from? So here from is minus 5 by 7 to get minus 1. So what we need to subtract. So what we are subtract means take some x. Now minus 5 by 7 what we have to subtract from this. So I want to subtract some x. So minus x is equal to result is minus 1. So this is the condition. Now let us take minus 5 by 7. So here is minus x is left. Now this minus 5 by 7 if you take this side plus 5 by 7 because that will be inverse. Now if you simplify this denominator is 1. 7 is LCM. Okay minus 7 plus 5 that I am taking. That is minus 2 by 7. So, minus x value is minus 2 by 7. So, cancel negative sign both sides. So, x is equals to 2 by 7. So, if you subtract 2 by 7 from minus 5 by 7, we will get the minus 1. So, this is the subtraction of rational numbers. So, we can see the similar some properties also in this. So same way similar like addition because in subtractions, subtraction does not exist a commutative property. So some properties is not exist. So I am not discussing all the properties. Now let us see multiplication of rational numbers.